Hey there fellow travelers, I'm Mark with Walter's World and today I'm here helping Jocelyn and today what we're going to talk about is what you should eat when you come here to Arkansas and you may ask, Mark, why is Jocelyn still in bed but you're making a video? Because I want to get some of the biscuits. Look, Arkansas makes some fantastic biscuits when you're here so you might want to get up early to hit up that breakfast cafe to get some of those biscuits for breakfast or you can have the biscuits later on in the day in some of the cafes and restaurants because they are really, really good when you come here. Also, you might see chocolate gravy on biscuits and I know for me it was hard for me to try it the first time so I'm like Hershey's chocolate syrup on biscuits that seems kind of weird but it's not Hershey's chocolate syrup they actually make the chocolate sauce here or the chocolate gravy I should say and you pour it over there kind of like biscuits and gravy yeah it's biscuit with chocolate sauce why not I mean it is actually a tasty treat and you know what it makes it okay to have chocolate any time of the day so you have that but biscuits are a big thing here another thing that's really big here is fried food look Arkansas is very much Midwest in terms of its fried food. I'm going to tell you that one right now. So fried anything is going to sound good. And they have fried food like Southern staples, like fried green tomatoes and fried pickles and hush puppies that are awesome. And they have excellent fried chicken. And it's not, apparently here in the Ozarks where we're at, they actually someplace will serve fried chicken with spaghetti. Who knew? But the thing is, if you're looking for something really fried in Arkansas, you also need to get some fried catfish when you're here. And just about fried any, anything. I mean, I had fried corn on the cob yesterday, which was excellent, by the way. Don't, don't knock it until you try it, okay? But, but really, the fried foods here are kind of a big thing. And, and if you can get one of those big fried pork tenderloins, um, you're welcome because they're awesome, okay? So you have the, the fried food family here. I mean, there's a lot of fried stuff. I mean, I saw fried squash. Um, like I said, fried pickles. There's all kinds of those things to check out. Now, if you want something a little bit less fried but just as tasty, you have a lot of good barbecue here in Arkansas, okay? And just like a lot of places, don't judge the barbecue joint by the outside. You judge it by the meat you get, okay? And you're going to get some really good pulled pork here. The ribs you can get that are good, brisket. I mean, you have a lot of good stuff that's here. But for me, you get a lot of those fried sides at those barbecue joints. So you can get a lot of different stuff put together when you are here. I mean, I had some amazing smoked mac and cheese. The kids loved it with some pulled pork on top. Oh, you can't go wrong. I mean, they love the pig here. I'm not going to lie to you. Whether it's the Razorbacks in football or basketball is probably better these days. Um, or just on the barbecue, you're going to eat really well when it comes to the pork. And that gets me thinking about a few other fried things I think you should try when you're here. I mean, like, literally, the fried stuff really is a big thing here. I mean, we had fried jalapenos, which are really good. But for me, we had this thing called Texarkana fries, okay? And what they are, it's like sliced onions and sliced jalapenos, okay? And they batter them and fry them. So like strips, like jalapeno strips and, and onion strips. They fry it up and you eat that. And I mean, it was so good. I didn't even take a picture of it. I had to take a picture of the picture of it because we ate them so fast. So something really to have when you're here. Another thing to have when you come here are fried hand pies. I guess the, the best way to kind of explain it, if you ever had the McDonald's kind of like apple turnover kind of thing or, or a hot pocket kind of thing, like the folded up, like little mini calzone kind of stuff. Look, I know I'm really insulting the fried hand pies here when I say that, but for you to understand what you're looking at, I mean, they are delicious. And you get them, I like the fruit ones. You get those, oh my God, but do be careful because they're fresh and you bite into it, you'll burn your mouth, okay? But like most of the time, they're just already fried ready. You can just grab them and go. You can get them at the grocery store too, so you'll be fine. But yeah, get some hand pies because they're tasty. And if you're looking for something to drink when you're here, I'll give that to Arkansas. They do make some really good sweet tea when you're here. Also, if you're getting some sodas, they'll say, would you like a Coke? And then you'll say, oh, I'd like a, a Pepsi, please. Okay, because Coke just means soda or pop in general when you are here. Um, another thing I think you should know about drinking when you're here is actually there's some dry counties here in Arkansas. So a dry county is where they do not sell any alcohol. Now you can have alcohol, like you can bring it in. It's like BYOB to the county, bring your own beer in. Um, but in a dry county, they won't sell it anywhere. Okay, so you might want to look and see if it's a wet county. A wet county, there'll be liquor stores that you can buy beer at the gas station and restaurants will have that like for example where we're staying right now I mean the liquor store was open on Thanksgiving Day so there are options for you but you do need to check out like what you're gonna have and what's available there and sometimes they have what's called a moist county uh, which they just sell alcohol at the restaurants and, and that's basically it there's no liquor stores okay also if you're looking to buy liquor uh, hard stuff and wine and things like that you can only get a liquor store you can get beer and softer things like less lower alcohol percentage at a gas station in some counties. 
And to finish off any food video and any meal in general, you need to have a dessert. And the dessert you should have when you come here, if you can find it, is called possum pie. And no, it's not made out of possum. I know people are like, it's Arkansas, blah, blah. no. Basically, you're looking at a chocolate pie, but it's like cream chocolate cream pie. I mean, it is super indulgent, super wonderful, super, you're gonna look like Mark after a few pieces kind of stuff, okay? So if you are here and you do see it, do grab it, because I'm a huge fan of chocolate pies, so it was like nice, nice, nice. But I will say, if you're allergic to nuts, a lot of times the base is actually, or the crust is actually made with pecans, so do be careful with that if you have a nut allergy. If you don't, go grab yourself a piece, okay? So, I hope I lived up to Jocelyn's expectations in this video about what to eat when you do come to Arkansas. If you want to learn more, Jocelyn has tons of videos about what to eat in different states around the U.S., whether you're looking at going to Montana and Big Sky Country to eat there, or heading down to Texas for some barbecue and other things, she can help you out. So hit that subscribe button for her, she really appreciate it. And also, if you want to check me out, you can go over to Walter's World and watch the uh, shocks of visiting Arkansas because we have a video just on the state of Arkansas. So I wish you all the best and have a great time and bye from here in Arkansas. Mm. Gonna get those biscuits now. <laughs>